there everyone and welcome to my Pokemon Emerald Nuzlocke um, this is a series I've been wanting to get just just started with for a long long time now uh, it's went through several changes um, it's been a uh, Moemon Emerald Nuzlocke uh, it's been um, an Emerald Wedlock it's been um, it's been uh, Expert Emerald Luck, it has been um, it's just been all over the place and this is just what I finally decided on um, it just seems like a good thing to do a lot of people right now are doing wedlocks of emerald it's it's odd and a lot of people are doing randomizers of emerald and since I've been doing nothing but randomizers lately I thought I'd you know tone it down a little bit and simplify it down to just Nuzlocke so uh, these are the rules that I am using for this challenge. Um, I'm going to change up a few things that most people do with their Nuzlocke's. So hopefully that will be interesting. So uh... Sir, okay, okay. Wasn't functioning there for a second. So uh, the basic Nuzlocke rules, uh, you may only catch the first Pokemon in a route or area. Um, this I will, um, if, if there's like a gift Pokemon like the egg you get from the old man and um... I believe there's a few other thrown in there, but I really don't know what they are. Uh, I'm not an expert on emeralds in any way, so uh, this is that's gonna be the fun part here. So basically, gift Pokemon those will count as separate things, and I will still be able to get like a capture there. So um, that's something. Uh, if a Pokemon faints, it's dead. Uh, I have to release or deposit it. I'll. I don't know what I'll do. I'll probably deposit until the end of the series or something. I don't know. And uh, this is an optional rule that people use of um, nicknaming your Pokemon for um, growing attachment to them and all that. So uh, uh, that's something. But I'm going to be changing that up a little bit soon. You'll see. Uh, I will be using Dupes Claws, which uh, I already see that I've made typos on here. Uh, Basically, you cannot use more than one Pokemon of the same evolutionary line. Like, um, if I catch a Zigzagoon on Route 101, not 201, because 201 is not in the game, I believe. I don't know, but I think it's 101. I, I, I don't know. Not an expert here. Uh, then I can't get, like, if on Route 202, apparently, apparently next route after that is exa exactly where you get evolutions. Basically, if I get a Zigzagoon, I can't get a line in later. Unless if I evolve the Zigzagoon into it. Um, and uh, duplicates, uh, most people give themselves a limit so they don't just abuse it. I set mine to 7. It seems a little high, but uh, lucky number 7, I, I guess. That's just what I went by. So here is me taking another drink of my beautiful Dr. Pepper, because why not? Okay. Now that hydration has been done, on to the next rule. Uh, the teleport clause. Uh, this is one that I don't know if I'm like the only one to, to do this, but basically, um, if there's a Pokemon that can use a move that makes itself escape, I'll have another chance to catch something. Uh, just because Emerald is so full of different things that do that, I know there's a uh, Horiyama that uses Whirlwind, Abra on the like the first couple of routes that use Teleport. If I'm just unlucky enough to run into a Pokemon like that first, and it just like first turn uses one of those moves to where I have no chance of catching it. Just think that I should have like a second chance on that, just personal role. Um, now this is the fun one. Nickname theme. Um, I've decided that all, all of my Pokemon will be named after characters in anime and TV shows. Um, I, I, don't, I don't know. Uh, a lot of people name them like after their friends and all that to grow attachment to them. But with, with anime and TV shows, you know, it, it's, you know, there's some people who get attached. I'm pretty sure if I uh, if I catch a Pokemon and name it Asuna, and I let it die, everyone everyone will like brutally murder me. So um, that's a thing. Uh, so that's the gist of the rules. Um, I don't know why I didn't like add more slates for the other things. I guess I was just lazy while photoshopping. But um. There's a couple more rules to add on to it. Um, I will be doing a shiny claws thing where 
always in my um, my series I run into shinies. It happened in Leaf Green and it happened in uh, Crystal. Well, those, those are the only two games that I've really played long enough that I could have encountered a shiny, but usually I encounter one shiny. So um, if I see one, I'm gonna catch it. That, that's just as simple as it gets. Um, trying to think if there's any other um, like j just basic rules that most people forget about, but they're still there. Um, I guess pinwheel claws could be an effect. Maybe I don't know how the routes are set up, but if it, if there's like something where the move the uh, not the move set but the um, the list of available Pokemon changes completely based on like it, it, if it's named the same area but the Pokemon you can catch are different. That then I'll count that as two different places. Um, Safari Zone that I'm only going to count as one area and. Uh, Anything else for Oh yeah, Pokemon contests are in this game, and if I get far enough to do them, I will do them. No one's gonna stop me. <laughs> um, I'm not a, the biggest fan of Emerald. I really haven't played all the way through it in a good few years. No, not without just like speeding through it like crazy. Um, before X and Y came out, I did beat all generations of Pokemon, but that was like a very quick run through just. Grab a Pokemon, beat the game, done. But, uh, th this Nuzlocke has to be much more serious. I am i don't know if I'll allow myself to look at my uh, my opponent's levels. Like, um, I've heard there, there are a lot of threats in the game, like Broly, not Broly, but uh, Brawly. Brawly is his name? Yeah, Brawly. Uh, he's really tough. Flannery, Watson, uh, Tate and Liz, I've seen them all destroy teams. So that could be an issue. So it could, it's going to be a tough challenge. Hopefully I'll make it through. And hopefully this series will take off like I've been wanting it to. Uh, put a lot of work into this one. Uh, actually spent the past... How many? A, a couple months on the GFX for this. Not not on, on this episode. I, I'm sorry about this one. But uh... Uh, on my layouts and thumbnails, I spent a good while on them, so hopefully they turn out well. Hopefully fan reaction is good. Um, maybe my channel will grow a little bit for the, from this. Uh, Nuzlocke's are really popular, so, you know, maybe I'll pick up something. Uh, also, I, I have to say, 3rd gen is my least favorite generation, even though my one of my favorite instruments are the trumpet. You know, what one of the main things used in this. Um, third gen has my favorite Pokemon in the game. And I'm also a huge fan of water types. I don't understand why I don't like third gen, but maybe this will change my mind. We'll have to wait and see. So, make sure you all join the next episode of Pokemon Emerald Nuzlocke.